The biggest mistake that we see homeowners overlook and number one is going to be the wrong insurance that doesn't protect you. Now, y'all follow me here because hail in Arkansas is common and let's say that the buyer's inspection turns up hail damage and the buyers are now asking the sellers for a new roof. Having the right insurance policy can well change our whole opinion of this situation. If you have an actual cash value coverage, that means that your insurance company agrees to pay you for the value of your roof in its current state. They are going to factor in depreciation, review its current condition, and estimate its remaining lifespan. So for an example, let's say that a new roof is $20,000 and your roof is 10 years old. It's lost 50% making the actual cash value 10,000 replacement cost coverage. The insurance company is agreeing to pay you what it would cost to replace your roof with a comparable new roof. Replacement cost plans, man, they're typically going to cost just a little bit more, but it can mean that you're out of expense of, well, getting the new roof is just your insurance deductible. And ultimately, y'all, check with your insurance agent on what your homeowner's policy is regarding the roof and what this can mean for you. Number two, not having a termite policy. And most everyone gets a termite clearance letter at closing when they purchase their home, and it's the new homeowner's responsibility to maintain that annual policy. Termite policies in our area for renewals are typically around 165 annually, and it's really important to make sure that your termite policy doesn't lapse because having a full service termite contract can protect you in the event that termites create damage to your property. And fun fact, the termite company policy, they're also gonna look for other things like carpenter bees and powder post beetles. They're also experts on organic growth prevention and can evaluate your property to ensure that you have the proper moisture barrier and you're looking to prevent or organic growth in your home. Number three, deferred home maintenance. That pipe that was slowly leaking under the house, man, it is a big deal and it can lead to other issues. Again, like organic growth in the crawl space of your home. It can also leave the pipe subject to weather conditions and it can get worse over time. Other things like not having a dryer vent terminate to the exterior of the home can allow for that warm, damp air to create other well, unfavorable conditions. These small out of sight repairs can certainly lead to bigger issues. Simple things like routinely changing the HVAC filter will keep the unit running in better condition. And even some of the newer units that are on the market have a safety shut off where if they detect airflow restrictions from dirty filters, the unit's just gonna simply shut, shut off. And if you pay attention to the little things, the big things really won't add up. Y'all, a home is an asset, and one of the main goals of home ownership is the ability to generate wealth through equity. So when it comes time to sell, we can use the equity in your home to get you to wherever it is that you're wanting to go.